with soybeans emerging, Lowell Sandell says he's receiving calls on controlling mare's tail in Nebraska fields. When we talked with the UNL Weed Science Extension Educator this week, he said getting a good kill on that weed might be difficult. We have seen mare's tail populations increase over the last uh, five to six years, and uh, some producers are still having a little bit of trouble um, getting the control that they would uh, want uh, on mare's tail, and it's very difficult to control. Uh, we have encouraged folks to do uh, fall applications with effective herbicides or get out very early in the spring when the plants are small. Uh, but, you know, some folks uh, haven't done that yet, and they're still trying to control uh, post-emergence. So now we're in post-emergence, what can you do? Well, it, it becomes uh, somewhat difficult, uh, at least in, in soybeans, uh, because w what we've seen is that the, the most effective uh, uh, herbicides uh, will only give us about 70 to 80% suppression. Uh, if we tank mix, uh, say glyphosate with a uh, first rate, or uh, if we used a contact burner uh, product such as uh, Cobra or Phoenix or Ultra Blazer or one of those types of products, um, we can burn the mare's tail back, uh, but folks probably should not expect 100% control, uh, trying to control it post-emergence.